Hello, this is Anne-Marie Sundy. I'm with Legacy Property Management. I'm one of the owners here and I have been managing properties for over 10 years. I'm also an investor myself. This short webinar, we really designed to provide information on turnkey investing and taking a look, a short glimpse at what the Denver market is right now. So I might ask you a question. Have you ever considered what your vision of retirement would look like? Are you interested in leaving a legacy for your family? And what would that be comprised of? Perhaps it's life insurance. That's a tool you could consider. Or maybe the stock market, although honestly, the volatility that of that option can sometimes scare quite a few away. Finally, or perhaps real estate might be another avenue you might want to investigate. In our opinion, if you are in the investing for the longer haul, above five to seven years and beyond, and real estate or quote unquote, the brick and mortar is always a great avenue for additional revenue sources, also a means to creating legacy of wealth, also a more stable in the long haul option. So I'd love to just spend a few moments looking at what the Denver market is looking like currently. These are statistics really for 2018. To give you an idea, the average single family home, that's about a three to four bedroom home, is about $460,000. Um, and interesting, some of the contributors for this increase in the house price is we are at an all time low for inventory. So this, it's a supply and demand thing. We do not have enough supply, so it is definitely a seller's market. I just wanted to give you an interesting statistic. In the 1980s, San Francisco was said to be at an all-time high with a housing price of 400,000. Today, those houses are over 500% greater. So that was a, it, so now in 20 years ago, that $460,000 house in Denver was probably about 200,000, 210. Today it's 460. In fact, the average appreciation in homes over the past five years in Colorado in Denver has been just over 6%, which I think is a pretty decent return, all things considered. So let's take a look a little bit at the rental rates and what those comprise of. Um, interestingly enough, the US Census Bureau did a calculation on how many hours does the average person need to work in order to afford rent. And they polled many cities, a large major cities across the United States. Uh, obviously Denver was one of those. And uh, interestingly enough, Denver is rivaling San Francisco. Uh, which means our rental rates are approaching those of San Francisco with the number one city, highest city in rent is San Jose, California. The Census Bureau predicts that Denver's population is going to grow by around 50,000 people per year. Now that's a lot of people looking for homes to buy. And since we have low inventory, they're also looking to rent. So what is the rental population comprised of? I get this question all the time. Uh, there's a large part of the Denver rental market that are relocating folks, couples, families. This is why single family homes are in high demand for a rental right now, because we have a lot of families coming in for the new jobs. Um, and then we are also seeing a, uh, the, the single family homes, excuse me, also rent quicker or lease up quicker than certainly condos and some townhomes. The last uh, area that our, our portfolio of tenants is comprised of are millennials. That would be the Gen Yers. And now some Gen Generation Z are getting old enough to go live on their own and rent. And they are seeking homes. And many of them like to cohabitate. So here's some things to think about. What is preventing you from investing? Might it be a fear of financing? The interest rates are going up, people say. So why would I want to lock in a rate? Well, that's just it. They are going up and the rates are still good right now. So why not? What about vacancy? Are you nervous about being vacant 
and having a house payment. How about property condition? Well, many think that I'll wait for the prices, the home prices to go down. The reality is, or the history that Denver market has shown over the past 40 years really shows trends of ever increasing or plateaus. In fact, over the last 48 years, there has only been three years that the market actually did a downturn. Every other time has been up or plateaued. More importantly, um, this will not be an overnight correction. We have minimal inventory. It's not going to happen overnight. And so the, the idea of it becoming a buyer's market where we have more inventory is going to take some time. Property condition and maintenance. These are all great reasons. Vacancy, property condition, maintenance are all great reasons to hire a qualified property manager to assist with, with these items. Hiring a property management company that one understands single family homes. They are very different from apartments and leasing up apartments, but they also should understand the importance of investing and as well as cash flow to the owners. And that's what we pride ourselves in making sure we are meeting those um, necessary criteria. I'd love you to, for you to ponder a couple of questions. If legacy property management could help you find the right financing, would that encourage you to add to your legacy? And if we came across the perfect investment property, are you ready to, to invest? With our team of property management and real estate professionals, we all work together with the owner to find the right and best investment. We can provide you with investments, worksheets that you can plug and punch in numbers to your heart's content. We love to provide rental analysis and rental run rates to see what we would list the home at, advise you on um, what you might want to do to the property to um, invest in it a little to capture a higher rental rate educate you on the time of market and create a strategic plan for that property and get you well on your way to leasing and management services. Legacy Property Management and myself would welcome the opportunity to explore what it would look like for you to expand your investment portfolio and create the retirement legacy you had thought about doing or hoping for. Uh, please never hesitate to call myself uh, or our real estate team, and just visit more on what it would look like for you. Does it feel comfortable for you? Get some of our ideas on creative financing or ask us, do we have any properties that are coming um, on the market or that we know of or that we have seen on the market that might be a great investment to add to your portfolio? I definitely appreciate your time today and I look forward to speaking with you soon.